channel. I hope your day is going great. I have some John Renault favorites to show you guys. Uh, the reason why we're bringing back the favorites is because the cap size has now um, extended up to a large in some of your favorites. So with your John Renault favorites, they all come in an average cap size. Some you can get in petite and now some you can get in a large. So um, there are actually, let's see, two, four, six, eight, and there's nine John Renault wigs total that you can get in a large. But John Renault has taken their favorites, like their most popular wigs, and three of them now come in a large cap size. And that is Sarah, like I am wearing here, uh, Blake, which is a human hair wig, and then Ignite, which I'm also going to do uh, that review here in a minute. But those are the three favorites uh, that come in this new large cap size. So on to Blake. I'm sure y'all, I mean, I have to step back to get all of this hair. I'm sure y'all have heard of Blake. She is a very popular style by John Renault. This is um, a very long human hair wig. Uh, the color I'm showing you is one of their most popular colors. It's shaded praline, which is 12 F FS8. Um, again, another customer favorite this uh, dimensional blonde with a little more of a caramel blonde and then lighter pieces running through it and then it does have this medium brown root to it so um i just i know a lot of ladies who wear uh shaded praline it's a very popular color uh so blake here she again is a human hair monotop hand tied wig that has the John Renault Smart Lace uh, front to it. This is um, the Smart Lace that is exclusive to John Renault. Now she is about a 17 inch piece and 6.8 ounces. She's heavier because these are human hair fibers. Um, I'm going to go put her on. She's definitely too big for me. I will tell you um, why and what to look for in a cap to make sure it fits comfortably on you, but I want to put her on just so you can see what she looks like if you're interested in this style, and then also know you can get her in a regular cap size as well as this new larger piece. So be screenshot ready. Here are all the details on John Renault's Blake. Here she is. Um, I don't know if I've reviewed Blake before or not. I'm trying to remember if I have, but if I have, I do not remember the fibers feeling this silky and this good. Um, this reminds me of like a Beltress fiber, synthetic fiber, um, how silky and good it feels. I've worn plenty of John Renault human hair toppers and I don't remember them feeling um, this silky. So maybe they've altered their human hair fibers a little bit, but they are it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful, shiny and very, very silky feeling. Um, okay, so let's talk about this large cap size. Now, your wig cap should uh, fit securely on your head, but not tight or snug. Like if you're getting a headache, if it just feels like it's squeezing and all of this pressure, then you probably have too small of a cap size. So in addition to how it feels, also how it fits your head. So it should not be um, sitting or bunching on top of your ears. If it is, uh, then you know that it is too big of a cap size for you. Also, the ear tabs should hit like right around your temples. They should not come uh, much further below your temples than that. Um, and these are coming almost to my cheekbones down here and it's like really bunching on top of my ears. And it doesn't feel very secure on my head. So all those things tell me that I'm wearing too big of a cap size and I need to go down to regular. So if you're wearing wigs for the first time, just be aware of how it feels, uh, where the cap is hitting on your ears and where those tabs are hitting on your temples. And that will kind of gauge if you need to go um, up to a large cap size, maybe down to an average cap size, or even down to a petite size. Um, so you should definitely feel comfortable in your piece. You don't want to walk around miserable all day because it's bunching or it's too tight or something like that. So um, always good to know um, what to look for for a proper fit. Now with Blake here, again, she has a smart lace front, which the hair is laying right on top of the lace. So you can see the lace comes down to about here. Um, but it is very delicate, very well done. Um, because this is a rooted piece, the fibers are going to, or sorry, the knots with the fibers are going to be um, a little more obvious on this. So you could, you know, pull it back like that. Just be aware that you might be able to see some of the knotting in it. But I love the, um, the root color. It makes the blonde look very natural to leave a little bit of a root. 
in there to give the color some dimension. As you can see, um, 12 FS8, the shaded praline um, does have some of the darker blonde and then mixed with lighter blonde pieces in it. Um, let's see, there's lots you can do with this. Because it's human hair, you can curl it, so you could add some curl into this. Um, of course, you can straighten it out again. Just be aware that with human hair, it's a lot more maintenance than with a synthetic piece. A synthetic piece, you can wash, let it air dry. It keeps its shape. It keeps its style. Maybe just shake it a little bit, wide tooth comb, you're good to go. But with human hair, you definitely need um, a head form. You're going to have to blow it dry, heat style it, um, use different products that are made for human hair, some heat protectant, different things like that. So. Just be aware that it's a lot more maintenance if you go the human hair route, but of course nothing compares to the realistic look of it, the feel of it, um, the versatility of it. I'm just a big fan of human hair. Um, so with this piece, there's already some layers cut into it. So of course you can do like the little pin back like I always like to do like that. You could do both sides back. You could do a ponytail. So much you can do with this piece because of the length and because it is uh, human hair. So. Let me do a 360 for y'all. So it's the left, back, and the side. All right, there she is. If you need Blake Large in your life, head on over to Wigs by Patty'sPearls.com. The manufacturer's John Renault. The style is Blake. She does come in an average cap size um, if you need her a little smaller, and then of course the new large cap size. All right, I will see you guys next time.